recap for Wednesday, October 13th. Today in class we used integer chips. So we could do a problem here. I'll just write it over here. For example, uh, 2 plus a negative 3 by doing this. Putting two positives and three negatives. And see how they just zeroed those out? Here, I'm going to do this a little bit different here. All right. One, two. Okay, so there are two positives and three negatives. And you can take a po negative and put it together with a positive, and they just go to zero. So this answer is negative one. Or negative five plus a negative six. That would look something like this. We'll hit start over. And this just says put up five negatives. And then six more negatives. And we have a total of 11. So uh, let's start that over. So that was negative 11. negative 11 and then we could do it with problems that like subtraction like negative 5 minus a negative 3 so I would do this I'd put up five negatives and then this says take away three of the negatives so I would just mark three of them and take them away so I'd have two negatives left so that's why we would have uh, the answer of negative 2. And then um, one of the more challenging problems look like this. Uh, let's go back here. Let's say that we had um, 5 and we were supposed to take away 8. So we're going about our chip business here. We're putting up 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then we're supposed to remove 8. So 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5. And I don't have 8 to remove. So what I'm going to do is add three zeros. 1, 2, 3. So now I see 8 positives, but only because it's 5. This is really 5. 5 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 and then we're going to subtract 8. We're going to split these into a plus 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 and now we can remove all these and these are remaining. So here's what it looks like right here. I'm going to remove 8 positives And the answer is negative 3. And it works also with negatives. Oops. Oops, let's erase this and let's try what is one of the most challenging problems, which is negative 6 minus 2. So so here we'll start over and I'll just start following the directions. Add six negatives. One, one, two, three, two, three, four, five, five, six. Okay, we've got six negatives. And this says take away two positives, but there are not two positives there to take away. So I'll put a zero and another zero. Now I can remove two positives. I'll remove that and that. And so the result 
is all of this. So this is negative 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And that is a recap for Wednesday, October 13th.